Hello everybody, it's Andrea. Welcome back to the channel. I know it's been a long time since we've done a colouring chat. I think it was before Christmas. Or it might have been the beginning of the year. I'm not actually sure. There are various reasons for this and I'll go into those in a moment. But welcome to the channel. If you're new to the channel, my name is Andrea and I make adult colouring videos. It's one of my main hobbies. Um, thank you for joining me. I'm glad to have you here. And if you've been here before, thank you for coming back. Um, what else what was I going to say? I don't know. Um, yeah, it's been a bit manic lately. I'm just looking for the right colour. Oh, there it is right on the bottom. Ugh. And everything's gone a bit bad, mad. So I can't find the one I want, so I'm just going to use this uh, Copic instead. Yeah, so today I'm going to be colouring in Chelsea's Pretty Creations by our very own Chelsea Jade Murray from Chelsea's Pretty Creations. Um, she has a YouTube channel. I hope you will uh, follow her as well. I love her channel and I love watching her videos. I used to love it when she did the makeup videos as well. Something I'm getting into at the moment is makeup, which I've not been into for a long time. But uh, so we're going to come in this one. So this is a funny coloured Copic called Barley Beige. So but I can't find the colour I wanted. So my skin's going to be this sort of weird colour. But she's a witch, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> so what's been going on? Well, ho oh, oh dear me. We have had a bit of a thing going on here. We've had a new bathroom and kitchen fitted, one straight after the other with a break of only about two or three days. It's been chaos. There has been stuff everywhere. Jennifer's had to sleep with me. Paul's had to sleep in a spare room. <laughs> just because there's not enough room for us all in the one bed. Uh, we've now got Jennifer back into her room, finally, which is lovely. Um, and it's just been chaos. I haven't been able to film because it's been so noisy with the builders banging and drilling. And I think I've, I've sort of filmed where I can, but it's not been very good. And then last week, when I thought, oh, I can get back to doing everything now. I can get back to doing eBay. I can get back to doing YouTube. It was half bleeding term, wasn't it? Yeah, of course it was. So there we go. So it's the end of February, it's payday, and I'm really happy. Because now I'm hoping to get back to this. Um, I've just recently bought some makeup. If you watch one of my TikTok channels, I've got two. Um, I've done an unboxing on my Andrea Life channel mm -hmm. of the P. Louise Christmas mystery box. It's not Christmassy stuff in there, but <laughs> it's the one they put out around Christmas. Um, their makeup and uh, stuff, and it's really, really nice. I got a a lip oil in tiramisu the color is gorgeous it feels beautiful it's so soft and oh it feels so nice that i really like it and i've just ordered yet another p louise box because i am that naughty and my battery's about to go and i don't think i've got another spare one we'll go until it runs out and then we'll swap them but yeah so I'm just, uh, as you can see, I already did the background for this, so I'm just now coming in to do the rest with you guys, because I thought it'd be nice before I go and pick Jen up from school. So yeah, it's, it's always hard to do stuff when Jen's off school, uh, off school, because um, she wants me to obviously do stuff with her um, most of the time. So uh, those of you who watch all the videos on my channel have noticed there was no book haul last month, there was no book reading wrap up last month. <laughs> Um, I managed to do my completed pages and um, a haul. There won't be a haul this month, um, so I've only got a few books. Uh, you will we'll probably see them though. In uh, oh, in something I don't know. I can barely speak. Um, on you know, in in future videos. So <laughs> this is a Winsor and Newton marker. I like these, and this colour is amethyst. So, so yeah, I mean the kitchen is gorgeous, the bathroom is gorgeous, it was just hard work getting it all done, um, there's still a few things to put away in the kitchen, uh, which I'll probably get sorted this weekend, with everything else that's going on, you know, it's been a bit of a oh, hard work, so that's why I've been a bit AWOL, I'm hoping to be back now, I'm hoping to get back to doing my eBay as well, because I miss doing that, um, you know, extra money is always nice. It's always uh, done properly through the tax, so not a problem there. 
I just need to, to get it sorted. But sometimes it's just a little bit hard when you haven't got much time. And the only time I have really is between Jennifer, um, between my finishing work at around one o'clock and Jennifer finished school at ten past three, but I have to go out early to pick her up. Now, next time she'll be doing something called Lego Club at the school on a Monday, which will give me an extra hour or so, because I won't have to pick her up till ten past four. But that's not until next term, after Easter. That reminds me, I've got to email somebody about Easter. Um, but yeah, so the nice thing is Jennifer loves this book, and there are some duplicates in here, like this one, there's two of this. And I said when I finished it, she can have the the other pages so I'll take the book apart and she can have the individual which pages that the pages I haven't coloured so I've coloured all of them except for the ones she wants you know except for the double so I've done this one but there is another one of it and I will leave that for Jennifer because she thinks it's a lovely little book so why not there you are Chelsea my little girl likes your book as well and she wants to colour in it so I said she could because I'm nice So yeah, doing that has been a bit mad. Um, I've been making TikToks here and there because they're easier to make, they go a lot quicker. But I haven't done a lot. I mean, I haven't done any book ones on the Andrea Life. Like I said, the only one I've done recently on Andrea Life I've done was one showing the bathroom and kitchen off. And then the one today showing me opening the P. Louise stuff, which is really, really fun. It's nice stuff as well. The, the palette, the eye, I got an eyeshadow palette and it's absolutely stunning. I love it, it's gorgeous. Yeah, I have to try and use it now. So yeah, I did order another one which also has a, a big eyeshadow palette. Now the next box was £30, the one I got, and the next box is 40 But you get an eyeshadow palette in it that's worth £40. If you were just to buy the eyeshadow palette on its own, it would cost you 40 quid. And then you get other items in it, but it's their skincare one, which I think is nice. So I'm going to give it a try. So I really, really like that. If you want me to show you what stuff I got from the P. Louise, um, I'll show you it on here when I get the next box as well. Um, I don't often wear makeup, as you know, but sometimes, I've, you know, I do like wearing makeup. It's just, again, it's a time thing with me, with Jennifer and all that stuff of getting to make sure I've got time to wear it and, and get it ready and get it right and I've never been brilliant at doing makeup and it makes me laugh that everybody wears such bright colours and they wear it really thick and heavy these days and they do and yet when I was a teenager I got told off I got called out for wearing heavy eyeshadow in fact somebody said to me you don't have makeup on love is that yet today nobody would blink an eye other than the fact that it was 80s style because it was like the late 80s early 90s but it just makes me think, well, you know, it's a bit daft, isn't it? How times change, and I'm quite glad it's changed that we can wear bright eyeshadow and lots of it, and it it doesn't matter anymore, you know, it's not... That's one thing I like about today. I love seeing all the bright colours that people wear. I have got a bright palette somewhere, I just can't find it. I thought it was in my downstairs drawer, and it's disappeared. Which means I've put it somewhere safe, but I don't know where that is. Like... You know, that happens. So the next P. Louise box is my treat for the month. I do need to get some clothes soon as well for the holiday. I will get them at the end of this month. So yeah, it's gonna be nice. It's nice to spend a bit of makeup, money on makeup for myself, because I just don't. And then I feel bad about myself and I shouldn't, I should just carry on. Like I said, I'm not very good. I mean, I'm not like Chelsea, she's brilliant at doing makeup, I thought, when she was doing her channel and showing all her makeup on Instagram. I loved it, I loved looking at them. Um, I'm not that good, but there you go. That doesn't mean to say that I shouldn't use it, it's just practice. And when I'm making a video another time for the channel, whether it's a book review, I will try and put some makeup on and I will try some of the P. Louise products for you. I'm just going to pull this back a bit so I can do the skirt. So, okay, so that's the battery changed for now. I doubt it'll last long, but never mind. 
So yeah, I have ordered another P. Louise one. This one is the uh, skincare one. Now I've already got one of the skincare items, which is the Balm Away, Melt Away uh, makeup remover, um, which is great. It looks really nice. So I'm going to enjoy trying that out. I'm going to try some makeup later. Not today, maybe, but maybe, maybe tomorrow. I don't know. Um, and I'm going to see what it's like to put on so, and take off makeup. Maybe Saturday because Jennifer's got a birthday party and I don't go to those because I don't like them. We can see what we've got. So I've been buying a bit of makeup later, lately. Um, I shouldn't. <laughs> lipsticks mostly. I love my lipsticks. But You know, it's, it's hard sometimes to uh, not buy things for yourself. You know, everybody wants to buy something for themselves. It, it's only natural. So I've, that's my treat for the month for now. And then if there's any money at, left at the end of the month, I will save half of it and spend half of it on something else. I thought I might buy something from Pee-Louise every month just to have a look, just to get some makeup and stuff in. I might try some of the others. There's the makeup cosmetics on there, but Pee-Louise was the one that came up most and of course it's in the UK so shipping was free which is always good it comes by every which used to be Hermes they're not the best but to be fair there was no issues it arrived today without any issues so I'm happy with that so that's all good and yeah it's really nice to have some new stuff um even when Paul said um he said a box for you I said yeah I've got it thanks he says makeup I went yeah he went oh good good for you so he doesn't mind when I spend stuff on that because he thinks I spend too much on colouring and stuff and, and oh just a second sorry that was my mum just ringing for some for a phone number I can't get the parents <laughs> no bless her that's that sorted. Anyway, yeah, so yeah, he doesn't mind if I do stuff like that. He thinks I've got far too much colouring books. You know, I think you might be right. I have over 400 colouring books. And I have quite a few PDFs as well. So, yeah, he's right. I have got quite a lot. So... It's nice to buy something for me that's not colouring related. Although I've got some pens this month, but nothing major. They're just some like Sharpie knockoffs. But there's not going to be a haul this month because I haven't got much to show you. I've got a few books, but not a lot really. So I'll wait a couple of months. I might do it in April. I might not. I might do it next month. It depends. I've got a couple of pre-orders coming. I had one come yesterday, which is really, really nice. And if I get a chance, I might do a flip through. But it really depends on how quickly, um, you know, because I've got to go get Jen in a bit. And if I keep getting interrupted by my mum, <laughs> it might take me a bit longer. Not been really watching much. I've been watching, obviously, a lot of TikToks and YouTube, like I normally do. Fascinating horror and finders, beepers, history seekers and all that stuff. But generally, I'm not watching normal tv a lot i haven't even been watching call the midwife which ended on sunday um last night we did watch something called dark land which is a true crime series um basically it's a cold case team looking at uh cases in south wales or in wales um so it's unsolved murder cases from wales um, and it's really fascinating to be fair I, we really do enjoy it so yeah it's really good so we've been watching that well it started last week but we watched it on um, BBC catch up iPlayer and it was it's very interesting very sad um, and the unsolved case last week was from 1939 just that literally just after war broke out it was actually oops, I've gone over a year oops, sorry Chelsea um yeah so this girl went missing she was only four 
1939 and was murdered and it was never solved. There is some evidence that it could have been a neighbour of her grandparents, I think, or her aunt, I'm not sure which, but they don't know for sure. Um, they are, they have handed over what evidence they have found to the South Wales police or whichever police force it is, South Wales now I think, that, that would be now dealing with the crime. It was different than those, it was Glamorgan police, Glamorganshire police. Um, so yeah, so it is fascinating to see these old crimes. I don't know what's happening in this week's episode, but um, we'll either watch it tonight or tomorrow night when Jennifer's gone to bed. The reason being is that neither Paul nor myself are capable of actually staying up late at the moment. We go to bed very early because I don't sleep very well. I'm a very light sleeper. And um, obviously if Jennifer wakes up, it'll wake me up. And sometimes she does. Last night she didn't. She did wake up at half past five saying she'd had a bad dream and I said, come on in then. Knowing that I get up at half past six, so it's not so bad then. But, you know, and she'll come in and sleep with me and it's like, oh, it's hard work because of the... But she kicks and wriggles because she's a child. Um, and I, it makes me so tired if she does that. So I'm hoping I'm not going to be too bad today. But sometimes in the afternoon, I get so tired in the afternoon, I literally crash out on the sofa. I pick her up, we come home, we put TV on, we have a, a drink and a snack together. And then I play my game lying on the sofa till I start drooping and then I fall asleep and Jennifer carries on and if she wants something she knows to wake me up which is fine I don't have a problem with that she knows to wake me up so it's all all good but oh yeah my goes I mean literally Friday night I was so tired I fell asleep on the sofa and Paul said to me I've ordered food and I went, ah, didn't even hear him because <laughs> we're trying not to eat as many takeaways because of the cost but he still you know, he ordered food in. <laughs> and very nice it was too. I'm not going to lie. Um, but yeah, so... It can be quite hard. with You know, when you've got a little one. And they want to play all the time. And stuff. It can make you very 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 tired and I do get very tired very easily Ooh. oh that one's the wrong way around and I never put put much on here I just gotta go and get a pen I want oh it's gone oh it's over there oh excuse me making silly noises I know I know here it is, a black one, and oops, that one's come out because the thing's come out. Silver, where's a silver one? There's got to be a silver one here somewhere. Like I said, this wouldn't take very long because there's not much there's one. to it because I've done most of it already. Yay. So let's give it some black eyeliner, black sparkly eyeliner. And some lovely big. She's got her lashes on. She's got her falsies on that. And this one. Whee. Oh yeah. Hee <laughs> hee. I love it. <laughs> so we're just gonna colour in the moons in this silver. If it works, there it is. Not sure why I put a black outline around that one. But I did. Oh, you can't see anyway. This one here. Yay! I like this book. It's why I put it on my ten books to finish. It's not a huge book, but there's some really nice pictures in it. And they're nice and easy colours. So, I really like it. I hope Chelsea does another one at some point. Because, you know, it's good. Just keep an eye on the time, because I haven't got long. I know the stars. This is my gold Pentel Dual Hybrid. I was going to use my um, Jelly Rolls, but I don't know where they are. 
There's, just, there's colouring supplies all over the house. In the front room, in the bedroom, in the office here where I am now, where I normally do my stuff. And then there's, uh, you know, so it does get, they do get everywhere. I do hope that you've all been all right and you've been having a good time colouring or whatever you're doing. I have been watching colouring videos. Sometimes I comment and sometimes I don't. It just depends on what I'm watching on, if that makes any sense. Because sometimes I watch on my TV and I haven't got my phone by me and so I can't comment. And then other times I'm just watching on my phone and I do. So it just depends. But yeah, it's nice finishes. I can't believe it's March tomorrow. This is I'm filming this on the 28th, and tomorrow is the 1st of March. Um, I did get my bonus from work, which I will be taking out of my bank and putting to one side for when we go on holiday. So I've got some holiday spending money. Um, other than that, I don't really need to buy anything. I need some stuff. We need some bits for the kitchen and that. But other than that, I'm not buying and the P. Louise I'm not going to be buying very much else so yeah I really like that box though uh, my cup I love my cup I'm taking that to work and I'm going to drink out of it because I think it's so cute it's like it is the most sweetest little thing I've ever seen and those blushes are absolutely stunning Oh, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to make a video showing you it to you when I want. I wait till the next box comes and then I'll show you all my P. Louise stuff that I've got. I know Chelsea wanted to see it, so Chelsea, I will be making a video showing you all the P. Louise stuff I get when the next box comes in. All right? Because I thought, yeah, it's the best way of showing it. I'm not going to be doing makeup on here. I don't do makeup tutorials. I can barely do colouring ones because um, I'm not very good at makeup, but. Uh, and I haven't got the patience to practice and try and learn and put it on and take it off, put it on again. I just get bored. So when I go out, I do my makeup and I've been doing it the same way for years. And yes, I could probably try something a bit different and I probably will. Now I've got some new colours to try. Now when I was a teenager, I would have tried any colour. I really would. I used to use purples and amethysts and reds and blues and greens and all sorts of colours. Now they do say, or they used to say, I don't know if, they, if it's a rule anymore, Never to wear the same eye sh shadow colour as your eyes. That me for me would be green. I don't know if that's true at all, but it might be. Any of you makeup art artist experts out there? No? Is that still a rule or does it matter anymore? So, there you go. Nearly done. A few more stars. And anyway, I'm not going to do much on this. I just I just like to straight colour this and I just want to do a quick catch up video with you all just to say I'm back. And although I'm not going to guarantee there's going to be one every single, every, every other day or two or three videos a week, I'm trying to try and do one colouring chat at least a week, maybe two if I can. Um, obviously I will still be doing the completed pages and the hauls when I've got enough stuff to haul and it is obviously. Um, but that's it, that's all I'm doing. Let's have a look. And there is my lovely little witch. So I hope you've enjoyed this very, very short, very, very quick colouring chat. And I will see you again in another video very, very soon. Bye everybody.